You don't have to be a photographer today in order to sell photos on these stock websites because we have AI tools. This website is going to put your pictures on each one of those websites. Whether it is Shutterstock, Getty Images, Adobe Stock, this website has got it all. But of course, until we just get our content on Wirestock.com, we firstly have to make it. And of course, you have multiple options in order to generate AI pictures. One of those, of course, is going to be Mid Journey. But of course, you have to pay for Mid Journey. But you have like Blue Willow, which is the same thing, but you don't have to pay for it. But of course, you have to write the prompts. And if you don't have experience with these prompts, if you don't know where to start, well, you will just spend a lot of time until you learn how to do it. Luckily, we can train another AI tool in order to do that for us, for example, like ChatGPT or even Bing Chat. Now, the reason why I don't like ChatGPT and why I like Bing Chat, which is a new chat bot by Microsoft as well, Bing is connected to the internet. So ChatGPT has pre-uploaded information, but Bing can connect to the internet. So if I wanted to train ChatGPT in order to use Midjourney, for example, well, I just have to feed the information to him. So I just have to explain everything hand by hand to ChatGPT in order for ChatGPT to learn how to use Midjourney. But of course, Bing can do it online. So what I have to do in order to train this one, I can just tell it like this. Look up how to use Midjourney. I want you to act as a prompt engineer. Okay, so that's what I'm going to tell Bing chat and what is this going to do well it's going to go on the research okay so you can see searching for how to use mid journey so bink has access to the internet it can go on the research and it can just learn how to use mid journey by itself so next on what you will do you will just tell him create me a prompt and this and this tile for that and that image. So you can see mid journey is an image AI generator, you know, blah, blah, blah. Then it will give you the information. And of course, it is going to give you the references. And this shows you where it went on the research. So you can just double check the information. And of course, you can just go and learn something yourself. So you can just ask it now the following. Imagine you are prompt engineer, I want you to generate a prompt for me, which is going to show how a picture of coastline hyper-realistic futuristic style so it will give you the image so it will give you this prompt which now you can just go and copy and paste inside of mid journey blue willow or whatever now i can just go over to this like for example blue willow or mid journey forward slash imagine you know how it works just paste that one and of course it is going to make me that image so what do we have to do now we just have to wait and of course you're going to get four pictures for yourself and you can see that this is a hyper realistic thing and of course you can now sell it online but you have to search for the topics okay so we have to research which topics are great today because in the same week well you can change a lot of topics and you can just use certain tools to give you those keywords because you have to like serve those markets you know you can't just go and create pictures out of a blue sky you have to know what are you creating and what are you searching for what do you want to give to those customers you know so in order to do that you can always go to exploding topics on google and you can just go to explodingtopics.com and this one works like a google trends but it's going to give you a lot of information so it's going to give you all of these topics that have been searched for in the recent time you know some of these are like as you can see members only but you can just take these which are free so regenerative agriculture so if i just click on this one it's going to show me what is this actually so approach to agriculture that doesn't simply aim to limit the negative impact to the environment but to actually improve it and this has huge growth okay so this means that it is something about farm Arms. It is something about agriculture. So what do you want to do now? You want to create the image which serves to this topic. So certain editorials, certain blog posts, certain videos on YouTube, certain I don't know whatever can buy your picture because they want to monetize their content. They can't just like take any picture from the internet if they just want to make money with it they have to buy the pictures because of the copyright so that's where you come in you can create these pictures with an ai tool and you can sell them for a lot of money now you can as well go back to microsoft bing chat and you can ask the following give me five picture ideas for the topic of regenerative agriculture so you can just click like that and of course it's going to give you five 
ideas that you can follow and of course that you can make money on. You don't even have to get these ideas yourself. Everything can be done with an AI tool and this is an amazing thing. So all you have to do now is to you just have to take these, you know. So you can see number one, a farmer planting a diverse range of crops and field, a group of cows grazing on a pasture, a farmer using a no-till drill to plant cover crops. So for example, I like this one, like a group of cows grazing on a pasture. So what I can do now, I can just go on and I can just put that into my mid-journey prompt. But there is another AI tool which I really like and it's called Leonardo. Now Leonardo is not working on Discord. They have their own web app and you can just join it. Just make yourself an account and first of all you're gonna see some of these recent creations which are like really really crazy and what you can do is for example click on it and you will get this prompt that has been used in order to like get this one. Okay so you can see what other people are doing. But if you want to find these like pictures which are related to your topics you can just go over to lexica.art and you can just search for example for some cows you can just search for some cows pasture you can just search for that and of course it's gonna give you something like that now you can see all these are related to our topic of regenerative agriculture so what do you want to do now you want to create some of these you want to take some of these because if I click on this one I can just copy the prompt if I click on this one I'm gonna get this one as well so you can see whichever one you click you will get the prompt that is being used in order to generate something like this so let's just say hot countryside and cows then let's go back to Leonardo for example and go to image generation and of course Leonardo is free you don't have to pay for it now I'm just pasting this prompt and of course I'm gonna get a certain style out of this now it all comes to you and how do you wish to create this because it will all depend on you and your creativity but for the end we just want to go and see how we can monetize this how can we get a lot of money with this and with one simple click so you can see the result now we just have to go and we have to sell this one and for that go over to wirestock.io which is going to do the work for you so what this does is that it will connect to all of these stock footage websites you know it has partnered up with all of those and for example you can see getty images adobe stock shutterstock alami pond5 deposit photos you know and this means that you don't have to go on each one of these and you don't have to apply as a contributor on all of these you can just use wirestock because as the name suggests it is wired inside of all of these and if you just make yourself an account on wirestock your pictures images and videos of course are going to be sold on all of these platforms you know so you don't have to go manually on each one of these but one cool trick that i gotta show you is that if you want to get a lot of traffic and if you're gonna get a lot of views and if you want to build some audience of your own you can just give out some of these pictures for free first okay so in order to do that you can use multiple websites you can use unsplash.com which is maybe the best one you can of course use pixabay.com or you can just use pexels.com but of all of these Unsplash is the best one for me because this one has more traffic than New York Times, believe it or not. Just have a look at this. Unsplash.com has 31.2 million total visits each month and that is showing that it's a hugely, hugely popular website. Now, this is going to serve you as a marketing tool, okay? So you are going to market yourself through Unsplash and a lot of people are going to see you. And once they start noticing you on all of these, Adobe, Getty Images, Shutterstock, Lamy, well, that way you're just going to get more sales. You know, more sales are going to happen and of course the more money you are going to get. So I want to recap this for you real quick because the most important thing is that for you to go on research to see what people are searching for and if people are searching for these exploding topics well you can be sure that someone is going to create a content around that topic okay because if they create the content they will get the money on their blogs on their videos 
I don't know, Instagram reels, TikTok videos, whatever. But in order for those content creators to create content, they need materials. And that's where you come in with the creation of that material, okay? Whether it's going to be image, whether it's going to be like videos, you can even create videos from these images, for example, using any video editing software, maybe like using CapCut.com. You can just do the research about it. But I'm telling you that you can provide all of these materials for a price, of course, and just look for these topics, okay? Sit down and just do a research about that one, see what people are searching for, and then just start making images on that, okay? And of course, sell it on Wirestock. It's a really good opportunity. If you want to do it, sit down and just invest your time. It is doable. There's a lot of money in it. So, guys, you go and take the action. I'll catch you.